Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. The pressure rise in the impeller should be equal to which head in a in case of a centrifugal pump to start delivering liquid. Kinematic head no, velocity head no, it's manometric head. See in the answer. How many grades of tolerance does the ISO system of limits and fits specify? A10 no, B5 no, C in the answer. 18. Which of the following is also known as a constant volume cycle? Constant volume cycle is auto cycle. Constant pressure cycle is diesel cycle. Dual cycle. Here both constant volume heat addition and constant pressure heat addition. I will draw the PV diagram. For auto cycle. One, two, three, four. Here constant volume heat addition and constant volume heat rejection. One, two, and three, four are isentropic process. Next, diesel cycle. PV diagram. Here constant pressure heat addition, dual cycle, both constant volume and constant pressure heat addition. Two, three constant volume heat addition, three, four constant pressure heat addition. Next, involute profile is preferred over cycloidal profile because. The profile is easy to cut, only one curve is required to cut, yes, this is the answer. Cycloidal, cycloidal profile, we have to cut two curves. What is the Miller index of a plane intersects the coordinate axis at x equal to 2 by 3, y equal to 1 by 3, z equal to 1 by 2. x equal to 2 by 3 y equal to 1 by 3 z equal to 1 by 2 take the reciprocal 3 by 2 3 by 1 1 2 by 1 LCM of 2 1 1 multiply 2 with 3 into 2 by 2 3 into 2 by 1 2 into 2 by 1 So answer is 3, 6, 4 D is the answer Zipper as a surface defect occurs in a casting process? No B. Welding process? No. C. Machining process? No. It's a rolling defect. Rolling defects are zipper, UV edge, cracks, and alligator. Next, what is the carbon content in perlite or eutectoid steel? I will draw the temperature versus percentage of carbon curve. Percentage of carbon here, temperature in degree Celsius. This line is eutrocted. Here, perlite 
जीरो पॉइंट एट परसेंट कार्बन सो आंसर इज बी द मोमेंटम करेक्शन फैक्टर बीटा इज यूज टू अकाउंट फॉर ए चेंज इन डिरेक्शन ऑफ फ्लो नो चेंज इन टोटल एनर्जी नो सी नॉन यूनिफॉर्म डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ वेलोसिटीज एट इनलेट एंड आउटलेट सेक्शन सी इज द आंसर नेक्स्ट वेन मेजर फ्रॉम इट्स बेस द सेंटर ऑफ ग्राविटी ऑफ ए राइट सर्कुलर सॉलिड कोन हुज हाइट इज एच विल बी एट ए डिस्टेंस ऑफ एच बाय टू नो एच बाय थ्री फॉर होलो कोन एच बाय फोर इज द आंसर सी एच वाई थ्री फॉर हलो कॉन हुई ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज यूज फॉर एग्जामिनेशन ऑफ क्राइस्टर स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ मटेरियल ए नेकेडाइन नो बी माइक्रोस्कोप नो सी ऑप्टिकल माइक्रोस्कोप नो एक्सरे डी द आंसर एक्सरे सब कूलिंग इज ए प्रोसेस ऑफ कूलिंग द रेफ्रिजरेंट इन वेपर कंप्रेशन रेफ्रिजरेशन सिस्टम सब कूलिंग आई विल ड्रॉ द टी एस डायग्राम ऑफ वेपर कंप्रेशन बी सी आर एस वेपर कंप्रेशन रेफ्रिजरेटर सिस्टम टी एस डायग्राम it increases the cop one two three four this is normal if we do sub cooling it will come like this four dash three dash four to four dash is extra cop earlier it was 4 to 1 now it is 4 dash to 1 so 3 to 3 dash is sub cooling it is after condensation or before throttling 3 4 process is throttling process so before throttling is the answer ए कार्नट रेफ्रिएशन साइकिल ऑब्जर्व्स हीट एट सेवन टू सेवेंटी केल्विन एंड रिजेक्ट हीट एट थ्री हंड्रेड केल्विन कैलकुलेट द सी ओपी ऑफ दिस रेफ्रिएशन साइकिल कार्नट सी ओपी रेफ्रिजरेटिंग इफेक्ट बाय वार्क टन रेफ्रिजरेटिंग इफेक्ट इज मिनिमम टेम्परेचर डिवाइडेड बाय वार्क डन इज टी मार्क्स माइनस टी मिनिमम सो T minimum is two seventy three hundred minus two seventy two seventy by three hundred minus two thirty so nine is the answer option A next two closed thin vessels one cylindrical and other spherical with equal internal diameter. and wall thickness are subjected to equal internal pressure the ratio of hoop stress in the cylindrical vessel to that of spherical vessel is this hoop stress is just sigma is for cylindrical to spherical cylindrical divided by sigma is spherical It's P D by two T divided by P D by four T. So we'll get four by two two. B is the answer. If the sum of all the forces acting on a body is zero, it may be concluded that the body A must be in equilibrium. No. cannot be in equilibrium no c may be in equilibrium provided the forces are parallel no 
may be in equilibrium provided the forces are concurrent yes this is the answer 1 kg of steam sample contains 0.8 kg dry steam calculate its dryness fraction dryness fraction x equal to mass of vapor by mass of vapor plus mass of liquid here it's 0.8 by 1 kg so answer is 0.8 c in a refrigerating machine if the lower temperature is fixed then the cop of the machine can be increased by refrigerant cop is r e by refrigerating effect divided by what done t minimum divided by t maximum minus t minimum t minimum is constant so cop is increased so this bracketed term we have to decrease cop increases if we decrease t maximum minus t minimum so t minimum is constant so we have to reduce maximum temperature t max increasing the higher temperature a no this is not b decreasing the higher temperature this is the answer b thank you for watching my video please subscribe me